Extended reality fully explained. The pandemic introduced us to a hybrid lifestyle that combined real world and virtual activities. We've all grown accustomed to the digitization of our routines, from working over Zoom to order groceries delivered to our door. And there's no turning back whether you love it, hate it, or are still trying to figure it out. Consumers and businesses will continue to place a premium on digital products and experiences. All of this is made possible by technologies such as virtual reality, augmented reality, and mixed reality, the combination of which is known as extended reality. These technologies are almost essential for anyone looking to improve their digital experience. So let's dive into this video to learn about extended reality and its uses, challenges, etc. And to never miss out on more meta trends, updates, and information, subscribe to MetaHub. Here we begin. Extended reality is an umbrella term for any technology that alters reality to some extent by adding digital elements to the physical or real world environment. It includes, but is not limited to, augmented reality, mixed reality, and virtual reality. Any new technology that combines the physical and virtual worlds is classified as XR. The X in XR stands for any variable, any letter of the alphabet that may be used in such technologies in the future. As a result, the term extended reality does not refer to any specific technology, it refers to any existing or future technologies that alter reality by blending the digital or physical worlds and by creating a fully virtual environment. XR versus AR AR is an XR subset. AR captures live video of a device's surroundings and adds visual elements, such as a Pokemon Go character in your living room, a tiger in a Google search, or educational markup in a workplace or historical location. To reiterate, while all AR is XR, not all XR is AR. For example, you can use your phone in a VR headset to play a video game. That is both VR and XR, but it's not augmented reality because there's no augmented slice of the pie. Nothing from the digital world is superimposed as a display of your surroundings. XR versus VR Extended reality, ER, includes virtual reality, VR. VR is an immersive computing and video gaming experience in which the device's display fills the entire user's field of vision. In some cases, this is as simple as inserting your smartphone into a headset that positions the phone screen an inch away from the viewer's eyes. But not all XR is VR and not all is XR. For example, augmented reality may use your phone camera to superimpose game characters onto your smartphone's display, as if the character were in the same room as you. That's augmented reality, and it's also XR, but it's not virtual reality. MR vs XR MR, also known as mixed reality, is a hybrid of two popular types of XR technology, VR and AR. To be specific, VR is immersion as in using a smartphone screen and a headset to fully immerse yourself in gameplay. Augmentation is when you use an app to superimpose a digital tiger in your living room and on your phone's display. MR is technically a hybrid of VR and AR, but the terms AR and MR are often used interchangeably. However, there is a distinction between MR and XR. Simply put, all MR is XR, but not all XR is MR. For example, a smartphone tape measure app is both MR and XR, whereas a VR video game is XR, but not MR. Challenges in adopting XR Skepticism The technology has yet to win over large audiences because consumers do not understand the technology's benefits and various applications. Furthermore, there needs to be more clarity on data privacy and security issues, which may weigh on consumers' minds when deciding whether or not to experiment with extended reality technology. Cost Because XR is a newer technology, it may have higher upfront development and equipment costs than other traditional technologies. Creating compelling content for XR users, for example, takes time and the support of developers committed to the technology. In contrast, users must pay for interfaces such as VR headsets and motion sensors. Hardware Issues The interfaces required to access extended technology, devices, and interfaces continue to face many challenges when accurately displaying visuals. As adjacent technologies such as 5G and edge computing advance, improvements can be expected, allowing XR to become more complex. User Experience Experts predict that the user can use VR experiences for 10 or more hours per day one day. However, users still report health issues from headsets for short periods, such as motion sickness, eye strain, and headaches. Benefits of XR Better training and development Extended reality technology is becoming a popular platform for educational institutions and businesses looking to help their employees develop new skills in a safe environment. Many benefits can be highlighted here, including knowledge retention, lower operational costs, and increased engagements. Learning Enhancement 
In schools and universities, XR creates a safe learning environment where students and teachers can experiment with experimental learning methods. Furthermore, extended reality can improve learning rates. Research shows that learners in traditional settings forget roughly 70% of the content they've been exposed to within 24 hours and nearly 90% within a month. Studies on extended reality, on the other hand, show that when technology is used in the classroom, students' comprehension and retention improve. XR can also help students with cognitive challenges or respond better to different learning platforms. Improved Customer Service Brands can use XR to reach new clients and provide innovative ways for them to interact with products and services. Clients, for example, can try on clothing or watch demonstrations, which can result in better experiences than the real-world offerings. Adopting XR tools can also greatly benefit customer support. Increased Entertainment Value Virtual reality gatherings are also becoming popular in the entertainment industry, with many artists opting to hold their shows online. We also saw a roster of performers dabbling in the metaverse in 2021. We anticipate an all-out boom in the industry as concerts, conferences, meetups, and other events all transition to all virtual environments. This trend will be especially noticeable in the metaverse as with Sensorium Galaxy, a metaverse dedicated to entertainment offerings such as music, dance, and more. Enabling Remote Work Distance work became the norm after the COVID-19 pandemic and the trend appears to continue even after the pandemic ended. Compared to 2D platforms like Zoom or Skype, VR, AR, and MR allow workers to better interact with their peers and collaborate more effectively. A virtual environment opens up new possibilities, improving employee and business performances. Applications of Extended Reality XR. Housing and Real Estate Using XR, one can find suitable housing via a brief walkthrough, and owners can also find potential buyers from various other applications, as there will be no need to physically go through. Sales and Marketing Companies can use XR to advertise their products and provide users with hands-on experiences with their products or service. This can be advantageous because companies will have to spend less money on advertising because they can directly provide their customers with the experience of using the product. Work from home in remote areas. Employees and staff can visualize a live environment of their office or workplace, attend meetings, and instruct others on working from their homes. XR can be used to do work from home, especially if the area is remote and difficult to access. Education and training. The use of XR technology can be beneficial to the industry. Students worldwide can find and select the best colleges and studies available in their area. Anyone, anywhere in the world can use this technology to study. Employee and worker training can also be done remotely using XR. Entertainment Industry The entertainment industry can benefit greatly from XR just like AR and VR. In addition, the entertainment industry can find new and amazing ways to profit from this technology. Let us know your views in the comments below, and if you are looking for some meta headsets or VR headsets in their reviews, subscribe to MetaHub.